this day. All right, so we got the sunroof. Um, we should go ahead and uninstall. So we should go ahead and um, take the screws and stuff all around. I'm gonna show y'all how I'm gonna do it. <clears throat> so I'm gonna have to take the screws around, take it off, and then I told myself I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna have to use this as a template. And I'm gonna put it on top of the car, go ahead and measure it out, go ahead and cut it, and then see how everything going. And then um, go from there, man. So so it's like six, it's right about 6.30 in the morning. And we took this off. I ain't want to just show y'all, you know what I'm saying, everything else, but if y'all, this the only reason I'm doing this, like I said, we're just changing it, and then um, some of my damn paint shit came up, but luckily this song I'm putting in ain't gonna cover up all of that, you know what I'm saying, gonna cover up all that, so you ain't gonna be able to see this outline, and then I know if I put the, um, put it back in, you, you gonna see it. So, yes sir, we finna oh, take that glue stuff off. And like I said, we gonna use that template over here and um, cut it out, measure it, do it, all that stuff. So, I'm gonna let y'all know, man, it's gonna be a big sunroof in there, it's gonna be a big difference. Like I said, once they cut the hole out before, it was just a little big. And even when I put the old one back in, you still can see like the ring around it, you know what I'm saying? So they just cut it out a little, little wider than what it's supposed to be. And um, I know some of y'all were like, man, take that out, man, put you a this, this, this. But like I said, I'm gonna do, you know what I'm saying, how I wanna do it. So, you know, you like it, you hate it. So um, just gotta know what you're doing and all that stuff. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, guys, right now, as y'all can see, I'm pulling the seal off, and that's gonna go back around. So it's like two pieces, I think it's two pieces on there. So you got the seal that goes around, that's one, and you got the one right here, two. So what we got here, I'm gonna took the trim part off, I'm gonna took the rubber off right here, and then, of course, I'm took that little headliner piece on. Um, I also done took the screws out of this, that way I can lift up and separate the glass. See what I'm saying? So, we can separate the glass. And now, um, you're not gonna get confused because, I'm gonna show y'all. You got one, two, and three. And you got one, which is one. And you got two and three three so you're not gonna get confused so doing this you might want like I said it's my first time but some of this stuff gonna be self-explanatory so basically how I'm gonna do it just how this piece right here lays over that means don't cut right here I'm gonna have to cut inside so I'm gonna use this template to see how I got it so I'm gonna have to pry this off though because I'm pretty sure it's glued down really good so I got a razor I'm gonna try to pry it off and right here I can see oh uh, like seal or glue is one of them probably seal though but yeah I'm gonna go ahead and try to pry it off and like I said we're gonna try to use this template 
to draw it out on a card and go from there. So y'all stay tuned. See if I can pry this thing off. Just do it like this. Just work your way down. Y'all can see that glue inside. All right, y'all can see, man, we got it out now. So uh, this is the template I'm gonna use to draw out the line. So y'all can see how big difference it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, let me see, it got, I'm gonna probably cut it like an inch right here. Instead of right here, I'm probably gonna cut by right here. All right, so what I just did, put the template on top and I used this to measure. Um, so I measure the end part from here. It was like 10 and a half. Then on that side, I did the same thing with 10 and a half. And I also me measured it long ways to make sure all that was straight as well. All right, so right now I'm gonna go in there and grab a marker or something like that and um, go ahead and trace it. And then when I trace it, how I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna go back and put this on just to see if that marker would be at least up in the inside on here. All right, so keep y'all, let y'all see what's going on. So y'all see how to measure it. That's how wide it's gonna be. Let me see. I probably gotta go get some blades though, but so I do got one. I might, I might use it. I got my grinder, but that grinder though, I can. I don't know. I can hit it on the money with that grinder. Just leave Harbor Freight. I had to grab some blades um, with my my jigsaw. I got the ones for metal, do sheet metals and all that stuff. So it should work. Yep, man. So um, like I was saying, once we do that, get everything situated, cut our hole, get it flush. Ain't no coming back now. <laughs> when it's when it's cut, it's cut. But um, I got faith in myself, man. Because if I didn't, I wouldn't even do it. Trust me, guys. I wouldn't even. I would have paid to do it versus me doing it myself. But I need, boy. Man, got the Ram twenty five hundred with the goose leg. So I don't know if I'm gonna use the grinder or the jigsaw. The jigsaw loud as hell. The grinder might do it, but I'm gonna go ahead and tape the outskirt of it. So it won't, um, you know, affect the paint part. So we're gonna do that. All right, so guys, I decided to go in the backyard and do it, man. It's still early, it's number like seven o'clock. Probably, probably after seven, but I don't wanna be too disturbing. So, um, we're gonna take the car, man. We're gonna take it to the back. I don't wanna be too loud. I'd rather be in the backyard versus in an opening. Put them sixes on back here. All right, guys. Sure that's on there. Ooh, that up. We're gonna go and get started, man. Like I said, we're gonna run the stuff on out. We're gonna get started. Be back here, it'll be a little better back here, so.
All right, guys, so we done got the hole. I'm gonna see if I can hold y'all up real quick without making a mess. So y'all can see, we got the hole cut on now. And so right now it's hot back here, so I gotta go back. Well, actually I got the damn long sleeves on. I got my gloves on, they about to bleed up, but of course I had to put these on, so all that metal won't chill on me. So uh, like I said, we got the hole cut out. Saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, Alright guys, so we finna go and go to the front man, get up in the shade. And we're gonna go on the stall of me. I got the tape around it, so we're gonna take the tape up, clean a little bit, and um shit, go ahead and test fit it real quick and um you know see what it'll do. Just cause if I gotta cut some more, I'm just gonna go ahead and bring the stuff here. I'm gonna go ahead and um see y'all up here in the front with me. That way I can go ahead and um install the sunroof thing back because I forgot I took it loose. So I need to install it. Because on the piece I think I got is a trim piece, you know what I'm saying? I think that's the only piece I have. So I gotta install this piece. Oh no mind. I got it. This the piece I'm looking for. Got a little piece I gotta cut off. All right, guys, so we got the ring in there. Right now, I just set it on in. What I did, I actually uh, got a real tight fit. So once I glue everything, I'm gonna have to put it in there. I'm gonna have to pry them up again because I want to do it. I'd rather have it shorter than long. I mean, than too much. So I can always go back off and cut the excess off. Yeah, it's all good, man. I look a little tired right now. You know what I'm saying? Your boy been working. So, of course, there's a little sweat on me. I got the, the long sleeve out, man. I'm doing a workout plus working. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, we just got the big roof in this thing, man. Y'all just stay tuned. Right now, we're about to take the rest of the stuff off, glue it, uh, screw everything back down and place it. But right now, man, we're doing a little backyard ride. You know what I'm saying? We're just going to bust a little block in the backyard. tuned man we got the big boy sunroof coming in this thing you know what i'm saying y'all stay tuned we got the fabric coming we putting a big 10 inch radio in this motherfucker we putting the speakers tweeters we doing everything headliner hey we upgrading everything man y'all stay tuned boy for this money carlo bill yes sir that's how we do it man backyard from the mud you too so we got it back in the front so like i said we finna take that cover part off I know I look a little rough right now. It's all good. And we're gonna go on, put everything back how we had it. And then we're gonna go and put the, I think I'm gonna wait on the seal. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Uh, I don't know. I might put the seal back on because when I get the, uh, the fabric, I'm gonna have to put that in. I think it went in the seal or it went on the outside of the, inside of the thing so i don't know so i'm gonna wait on the seal but we're gonna go ahead and install everything else yeah i, I think it's gonna i think i'm gonna tuck it that fabric up in here and be done with it so yeah that's what i'm gonna do but y'all stay tuned um i'm gonna go ahead and take everything clean up everything um i got the whole inside man it's just a whole makeover man i told y'all it's gonna be a whole makeover man y'all stay tuned man 10 inch stream coming scoops damn Coming soon, headliner coming soon, Tweedle speakers, 
all this stuff, man. And shit, hey, later on, I want to change my pedals out too. Hey, later on, man, we might find some sound. You know what I'm saying? Throw a little sound in the mug. And goddamn, I got the box too. So I might just go ahead and order 215s. Not nothing major. I ain't trying to beat the trunk off. I ain't trying to do all that. I just want some, a little slight. So I might just throw 215s in the back. Go on and hook the amp up. Um, and go from there. I might find a system or use my own system. I know I might use my own system. Because since I got the box and everything, I just do it like that. So yeah, man, we're going to, we're going to, hey, one o'clock is going to be ready, man. And then we can be able to bump and, and slide and all that stuff, man. So definitely stay tuned, guys. And we're going to get them exhaust fixed too, man. We're doing that. Then we're going to put the tips at the back, man. We're running this thing. Hey, y'all stay tuned for the bill. I'm telling you. Man, doing this shit right out the backyard. So we got everything measured. I just took this back off. We about to go ahead and install sunroof glass back on this. And after that, we're going to go ahead and uh, glue it and put it in, man. So, hey, y'all stay tuned for the final result. All right, guys, man, it's got dark on it now. <clears throat> but, man, we've been out here working. I actually went in the house and came back out. We got the big boy sunroof. Oh, that been pretty, too. Boy. I ain't gonna lie to you. Big boy sunroof installed. Everything good. We just waiting on the headliner, guys. There wasn't nothing to it, man. Nothing but to do it, man. But, yeah, she's... Whole lot better. I'm gonna pop it up so y'all can see it as well. Whole lot better. Oh. That's what we got here. Big boy. Like I said, it's a little dark right now, so you can't see it, but yes, it's the pop up. It's the pop up. It's all good. It's the pop up. But you can go either, like, hold on, let me see. Yeah, you can go like that. You know, just to put a little. What's your name on you? Boy, you can go all the way high. That way you can, you know, have it high. Damn. Let me show y'all how it's gonna look from the back side real quick. So this is what it looked like from the back side. Oh yeah, that'd be pretty pressure, pressure. And then I'm show y'all. y'all what it look like on the front side because y'all gonna have to probably get used to it oh that bit pressure up so i can do it midways or i can do it high really don't even matter pull up to the city with my city let me see so I'm finna bust a little block real quick. Shit this, shit this dough. Yeah, man, y'all let me know what, what y'all think. Let me know how it turn out, how it look, man. All right, man, we riding this thing. Got this window up, <clears throat> and I got that window up. But we got this sunroof up as well. I'm gonna bust a block through here. And a good thing I like about this car, you don't hear no wind. Nothing like that. Matter of fact, let me. Hold on. I hear my damn exhaust though. Yeah, when I let it down, you can't hear nothing in this mug. Oh, hold on. One second. Okay, I have to open it back out. But I can't wait till the daytime and see how it look, man, the daytime. But this sorry way bigger than. Like I said, this sunroof now weighed on this side. We weighed on this side, so that's good. But we're gonna let down the window. Let down the window to get a little air breathing in this thing. I know y'all ready to see what's next. Y'all ready to see what's next, man, on the bill. You know what I'm saying? Like 
shit. I only go all the way out. Might as well do something. I'm gonna change this, uh, not the fuel filter, but, uh, I wanna put a new, what you call it, assembly? Should I say assembly? Something like that in here. Spark plugs. I feel like I want to change the spark plugs in here too. And the wires, new oil chain. She kind of, she kind of starting to get a little misfire. When I hit on the gas, she, she kind of stutter a little bit. So it could be the spark plug wires, oil chain, I'm pretty sure these spark plugs probably they probably filed out now. Ain't no telling. But uh, it could be one of the two guys. But yeah, man. So y'all can't see me, so we feel the road. But let me know how I did, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, bad or good? Just let me know what y'all think. What y'all prefer? So it's all good, man. Catch y'all next.